Welcome one and all to the Work of Wrestling YouTube. My name is Tim Kale and I am the host and creator of the Work of Wrestling podcast and website. My pronouns are he, him, his, and for today's video I'll be reading an excerpt from my article, The Importance of Poses and Gestures in Professional Wrestling. If a pose is directed toward the crowd, then a gesture is directed toward an opponent. The crowd can perform this gesture too, in fact it often does, but within the context of the story being told in the wrestling ring, a gesture represents a symbolic exchange between the wrestlers, or communication about the status of a wrestler's position in the match. Think The Rock's Just Bring It hand motion, calling his opponent towards him. Think Roman Reigns cocking his forearm like a shotgun before delivering the Superman punch. These gestures come to represent some aspect of the character's makeup. In The Rock's case, he is confident, fearless, and charismatic. In Roman's case, he is strong, ready, and capable. Both gestures communicate a lot about the character's mental and emotional status. The audience, recognizing these gestures, eagerly anticipates what's about to happen next. This represents the power of pattern recognition in professional wrestling. Watch it enough, and you can start to learn what these gestures mean, particularly as they relate to the beginning, middle, and end of a match. A well-placed gesture breaks up the action and avoids monotony. If a match was nothing but a sequence of moves strung together without interruption, it would be pretty boring. Poses and gestures allow for contrast in a match, for the performance to ebb and flow in a way that keeps it interesting and exciting. An effective gesture will contain the history of a character or group. Take DX, for example. From now until the end of time, Triple H and Shawn Michaels will be synonymous with the suck it gesture. And whenever this gesture is performed by a present-day wrestler, it's an homage to Triple H and Michaels. The crowd, recognizing the gesture, is taken on a quick detour down memory lane, and they're flooded with fond feelings. That's how much these gestures mean to pro wrestling fans. They are a part of not just an individual wrestler's story, but the story of all professional wrestling. These gestures hold within them every pop, they ever elicited, and the immediate promise of the next. Alrighty everyone, that about does it for this video. You can read the full article on workofwrestling.com right now. So go to workofwrestling.com and find this article and read it and let me know what you think. You can reach out to me on the social media gimmicks at Work of Wrestling on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. If you'd like to get one of my t-shirts and support me, you can get one just like this. Wrestling is Shakespeare at ProWrestlingTees.com slash Work of Wrestling. You can also become a patron of my Patreon at Patreon.com slash Work of Wrestling. Remember to give this video a like and share it with all your pro wrestling friends. Alrighty, everyone, that about does it for me. Thank you very much once again. Until next time, go out there and find yourself your moment of pop.